Good evening. It is Tuesday, March 22nd. I've pretty much lost track. I think it might be the 25th day of the build. 25 days since I received my first bot mail package. Uh, and I've started also on the pink Prusa since then, which is this machine right here. It, I did receive my motors from Util Machine. They are good to go. I'm all mocked up, ready to go. There is no reason why I have not hooked up the the Gen 6 port I got from Botmail, other than that Botmail did send in a new set of parts. They look great. 100%, 1000% better than what I had before. It even came with a new Wade's extruder and all new parts. So that looks great. And a bolt, Wade's extruder bolt. One thing that did uh, kind of confuse me was that gear right there. There are no set screws or grub screws to install on that. It's just kind of flat on one side. Just a little bit, barely there. So maybe I'm going to have to count on friction to keep that thing on there. There's the Y axis. So but since I had my Prusa, Prussia, whatever, all knocked up, ready to go, I'd go ahead and finish this. I am going to order some electronics, a new print bed because that one goes to the bot mill kit and I do have on order some new timing belts and actual aluminum and, and st uh, plastic gears that I'm going to be ordering or I already have ordered. So there's my extruder, everything's mounted ready to go. There's no reason why anything shouldn't be working. Uh, let me show you something real quick. My uh, Y bed is nice and smooth thanks to the help of Space Ecula. Pretty much as smooth as I can get it to go. And it's got a pretty heavy print bed on there. I'll lift that off. Just a little bit stiff. I don't know why it's doing that. It's got a belt on there, so that might be why. caught up a little bit. So yeah, everything's nice and smooth. My uh, x-axis rotates nice and smoothly. Z-axis works. I'd show you, but it's all mounted in and it's got to, I got to wire it up for it to work right. So yeah, so I'm going to order some Gen, uh, not Gen 6, but ramps because I need the accessibility of a heated print bed, which you can't use with Gen 6. And once I get that done, I'll get that machine running and get back to work on the bot mail one. <laughs> get all these things printed up quickly. Speaking of uh, the backers, uh, I've decided that I might split up some of the workload between me and the other printers and order some from a few other guys that might be working on similar projects just to kind of get them out and get them done quickly. So you guys might get them sooner than expected. All right, so that's a short, quick update. Thanks for backing me up. Thanks for watching the video, and uh, please like it.